huge welcome. This is the first video lesson of mine in 2018. So there's two parts to it. First is a brief idea that I'm Mike Downs and I make videos to help people learn and I'm also uh, a teacher. So in 2017 on my YouTube channel I made 263 public videos. That's about one a day on a five day week. In total I've got 826 so there's tons to choose from and I want to make even more in 2018. So if you get to one of um, these video lessons and you haven't learned anything at the end I have messed up big time so please let me know. So in 2018 part of it I want it to be about using a cheap mobile to its full potential. On a recap this time last year I bought a Moto G4 on Android 7 and I see this phone as a privilege for me and a luxury to use. And getting down to the second part of this video and the main portion, as an example, I'm going to provide an introduction to the Be Funky Photo Editor. And in my phrase, where the small is the new big, which means that if you hold a mobile phone, you know, like maybe the one you're holding now, in portrait, it fits in the palm of your hand. We know that very much. But let's take a step back for a moment and understand what the setup is. In this example, Be Funky is a photo editor, a collage maker, and you can do a bit of exploring as well. What I want to do in this part is say, just because you're holding the mobile phone in your hand, its potential is big when you produce a photo or a slide. So what you can see on screen is if you literally hold your hands up in front of you now and say look about four wide by three high and please you know wave your arms around wave your hands around to say the potential that you're giving out to make something is a really big picture that goes on the wall it's something to be proud of something to look at and say I did that it was my photo it was my collage whatever it was and this is what I mean by small is the big if you go in and you say to yourself I've just fiddled about with my mobile phone and hit save. If it's printed in real life big, it could be worthy of going on the wall in a big frame. So how do we get there? If you open up, this will be part two, but this is a summary. The Be Funky photo editor has some little buttons along the bottom. And for your uh, convenience, I've already had a look at them and said... If you look at all those things, every time you go in and investigate, like almost like the, the roads in a town, you'll find six things to set or look at in home settings, etc. You'll see that there's 34 effects, 76 in the pro version. So what you're doing actually with this editing, although the simple aim is to load an image, edit it for a little while, save it and then share it, you're talking about 100 or 233 things that could be happening, which makes it very, very similar to a journey, where if you want to set off, in this example, it's across London, there are loads of different ways to get, it, to get there. There are loads of different ways to get lost in the process. And it, depending on, on your attitude and your setup, do you approach any kind of like app, shall we say, or process like a game? classic is snakes and ladders. You might start off on number one, you know, throw a five on the dice and be vaulted up to number eight. But if you do really well and you head up to number 27 and you hit the green smiling snake, boom, you've just slid all the way back to number one. And this could be incredibly frustrating. To use another analogy, let's look at a maze. This one's in Scotland, where you might start off and it's a great fun on a Saturday or a Sunday afternoon and after a while you think, God, I'm lost. Goodness, what am I going to do? I need an overview. Tra Quare House in Scotland. It might even be that you've got this overview and it still doesn't help. Can you see where we're going with this? Meaning that you can come down and say maybe a friend or somebody gives you a rough idea of how to get in, get to the centre and get back out again. You think... Oh my goodness, I've got my head in my hands, I'm frustrated, I'm fed up, and I'm not going to do it anymore. But we actually need a sense of arms in the air, absolute elation that we have won or we are achieving something. So, to get started, really, we've got to say, look, 
Let's get the Be Funky app in this example. Let's load a sample image. The one that you see there is my sample image, by the way. And then we need to go to part two. And in this series, we have got, and this is me trying to plan ahead, and I'm doing it in sets of three or sets of six, is to say that number one is this video, it's the introduction. In the next part, I'm going to look at the Be Funky free app and go through those big long list of features. Not all, but to try and give us a guide. Number three, I'll look at the Pro. Number four, Collage Maker, and so on. And at the moment, I've planned about seven that I want to knock out as quickly as I can. So you've been watching, listening to Mike Downs at YouTube, and this video, as a marker, was recorded on the 3rd of January, 2018. I used Google Docs Mobile, by the way, of what you're seeing with all this um, sliding around, and AZ Screen Recorder. So Happy New Year, everyone. Put your arms in the air and say, hey, we can do this, anyone can do this, with a little bit of help, a bit of patience, and some persistence.